No pause, only play. Boss, I heard you were looking for me. Boss, he seems to be in a bad mood today. Oh no. Come on in, buddies. It's your Aunt KJ, and welcome to No Pause Only Play. Today, we're playing a 24 hour game called Rule 7. Let's get straight to it. Day one before work, come um, to as many NPCs as possible, explore as many items as possible on the map. Some description uh, decryption relies on certain special items. You mean decryption? Description or lower difficulty? You so sleepy. Go to work this early. Just keep walking along the road and you'll see the subway seat. Hurry up and let's go. All right, who are you talking to yourself? <laughs> talking to me, bro? Like, I feel like you breaking the fourth wall on that one. A big old trash can. How short am I? Oh my goodness. Okay, don't go that way. Or maybe you do go that way. I don't know. Son ain't playing. My phone rang. Dear user, you have been selected to participate in Rule 7 test. Congratulations. The program will be automatically installed on your device. Please wait for it to complete. Now, let me give you a brief introduction. That's why you don't answer your phone for nobody, bro. You don't know nobody, you don't answer the phone, bro. All right, testing period for this program is one week. During this week, you will be subject to seven rules. Simply follow the rules. Rules will unlock as time progresses. You will receive notifications when new rules unlock. If you violate certain rules, unfortunately, you will have nightmares that night. You will be safe within the nightmare, but it will serve as your punishment. Thank you for participating in this program's testing. We hope you have a great time playing this week. The call ended. I discovered that the number belonged to a former female colleague who, oh, okay, who had already left the company. After she left, I lost contact with her. Where could she be? Perhaps I can find some clues at her desk in the office. Maybe I should check her locker. Check the phone. Go to work, they say. This is how slow we walking? Where my feet at? Okay, it's made it 24 hours. We're going to just let it slide. This the office? Hey, ain't nobody working. All right, I was about to get to the subway station. I'd be mad as heck if I was, if somebody was like, hey, bro, if somebody could just install something on my stuff without me at, like, I'd be upset, bro. Like, big mad, homie. Hey, what's up, Rico? What you up to, bro? I would, I want to talk to the boss about a raise. Would you like to go to the Easy Kaya near my place tomorrow night? Let's relax a bit. Okay, it's been a while since I heard the boss scold anyway. Don't you know, the company's been in a slump lately. But those management folks won't have their salaries reduced by a single cent. You're right. Hey, would you like to go to the Izakaya place in my place tomorrow? Tomorrow night? Sure. Occasionally relaxing sounds good. I'll be waiting for you at the Izakaya tomorrow night. Okay. Male colleagues will go to the Izakawa. What is the Izakawa? Alright, so I gotta go check a locker. Dang girl, why you looking? You the boss? Boss, let me get a raise. You buff, ain't you? What impressed you the most when you first came to Japan? Haha, <laughs> there's indeed something that's been puzzling me. I wonder why your cars are all so clean. Oh, you white. Okay. Maybe, I don't know. Not a speck of dust. You wash your cars every day, but I haven't seen anyone washing their car every day. Lie. There seems to be a strange person dancing outside the window. Huh, really? I'll go check, but your observation skills are really keen. What? What you doing over here, bro? There ain't nobody over there. Hmm, seems to be a clock. I don't have know the password. Okay, I gotta find the password. URL town online store. What the heck does that mean? Do I gotta shop? Okay, let's shop. What are we doing? What is this game, bro? My man pulled his chair out. Okay, go ahead, bro. Uh, let me get to the. Let me go to the URL. Get the toolie. Spaghetti. Why am I buying anything? I don't even know. Do I got money? What are we doing? Uh. Remember to eat at lunch. Okay, I got money. I'm breaded. Suspected crime count. Hunger count zero. Boy, what is this? The Sims? I thought it was a horror game. I can't just take somebody else's lunch. Poke a hole in the bucket. Why would I do that? Poison? What's wrong with me? What kind of life is that? What kind of life am I leading? Why I got to poison people? Push her out? <laughs> I think we good, bro. What the password is, Kent, the day I come to save this world. What? I don't know what any of that means, bro. Yo, this game already wild. I don't know what's going on. I could kill people for some reason. What happens if you push her out the window? I'm not too curious, bro. Hey, get out that window, girl. The window is loose. I can't push it. Okay, oh, loosen the screw. I don't have the tools. Okay, I got to have tools to push her out the window. And commit murder for this woman that don't seem to have done anything. Okay, I got a key. 
What does Key go to? Girl, what does Key go to? May is the boss office. Hey, boss. No, this key go. Damn, boy, you ain't good. I don't even share nothing. I want some of that food, bruh. Okay, I don't know what that key go to, so we get it. What's up, homie? Are you black? Boss. I heard you were looking for me. Boss. Boss? You gonna jump out the window? I haven't done anything wrong. Why is he saying anything? Boss? Did you call me for something? Boss? He seems to be in a bad mood today. Oh no. I get startled every time he suddenly turns around. Why you do that? What's wrong with you, black man? <laughs> he said, you know what? The recent revenue of the company's projects hasn't been very optimistic. I was just looking at that window because I was probably going to jump out of it. I just checked last week's attendance reports and you had the least attendance time among everyone in your group. I don't know what you're thinking. Aren't you worried? I'm definitely in a hurry. In a hurry to do what? Every day when I eat, I'm thinking about how to bid and how to promote. There's so many colleagues around you working overtime. I hope you can learn from them. Yeah, I learned to not do that. I value my time. After giving it some thought, starting from today, we'll add a personal daily report section for employees to be submitted before leaving work every day. I'll read your report carefully. I hope you can learn from your team leader. Who's my team leader? Who is you? Hurry up and go eat. What are you still doing here? You don't rest well at noon, and in the afternoon you work while sleeping. Are young people like you so tired? When I was young, I wasn't like you at all. Well, yeah, man. You're black. I'm pretty sure I'm Japanese. What's wrong with your body, man? Your elbows tucked in? Boy, oh my goodness. I like your, your, your soap, though, boy. It's sharp. You good, though? What's wrong with your eyes, bro? That boy, he got to be on something. My man definitely on the drugs. Hey, y'all seen Boss Man? He on that stuff, y'all. I'm telling you. Eating homemade bento every day. Yeah, I only like eating the food I make myself. As long as there's nothing else going on, I make my own bento at night. It's also kind of enjoyment. I think he meant enjoyable. Anyway, let me go get that raise, bro. Let me get my raise, bro. I don't care about all them other problems. Let me get the raise, Boss. I need me a raise, homie. I will tear anything up in here, bro. You a hater, boss. All right, so I don't know what that key goes to. I don't know where the password is. Hey, girl, you see that dude dancing? You two find a person dancing? Okay, I remember to eat lunch. Do I go out and eat lunch? Let me get insulated gloves. What we out here doing? What we think we are, OJ? Spaghetti. I bought the tools. Oh, I did. <laughs> Okay, I wanted the spaghetti. Spaghetti, man. Let me get the spaghetti. All right, girl, tomorrow you're going out that window. I'm just kidding with you. Maybe. It's already lunchtime. I slept over my desk, drifting into a drowsy sleep. After a while, my consciousness gradually clears, and it seems like I've entered a dream. Oh, is this the nightmare because I didn't eat my food? I was supposed to eat food, but I didn't have no food. This will be this is about the boss, ain't it? Hey, boss, I didn't have no food, so I couldn't eat. I know that broke the rules. This lamp is on. Oh, my man left his food out. All right, let me get that, bruh. We got the fresh bento just chilling. All right, man. I'm just going to leave to wake up. Day one, after work. All right, I'm back. I'm back home. I'm heading back home. He said he's going to meet me at the Izakaya tomorrow. Oh, somebody in here today. Hey, girl, ain't nobody ever come up in here. It's just me all the time, ain't it? <laughs> Y'all going out of business soon. I'm just saying. Uh, hello, excuse me. What's available here? Oh, looks like a new face. Yeah, the only face. What are you talking about? Oh, there, there aren't any cus many customers during this special period. A store provides free chatting service. Do you have any hobbies or interests? Or perhaps you'd like to hear some ghost stories? I could chat with you about either for a long time. Our store is one of the few isekais still open in this area. We won't close unless the earth is destroyed. How y'all funding this? Take a look at the menu first. Let me know what you like to order. All right, let me eat a. Uh, let me get a. Let me get a salad, man. Did I eat? Thank you. Okay, thank you, man. I right, so I ate food. Okay, you didn't want to talk. Um, steal money out the register if I want to. I guess I need to save money in this game. 
So far, I'm good. Though. Okay, I'm going home, girl. Thank you. Yes, sir. You got the sushi? Are you the boss? Welcome. Please have a seat, young man. I'm the boss here, and I've been running this shop for over five years to zero customers. Although the variety of dishes isn't extensive, they're all my specialties. Would you like some alcohol? I have top-notch whiskey here. Okay, man, y'all all, all your food costs the same. An empty bottle, not much you. Hey, fill this bottle up for free, homie. Huh? I need to take that to the house. All right, bro, I'm gone. So don't run that way if somebody's chasing me through the streets. And don't run that way because there ain't no escape. Got it. Let's go home. Okay, we home, bro. Day one, night. A rule has appeared prohibited to turn on lights in the bare room. Peeking at the neighbor for one minute is the second rule. Okay. Okay, I got to peek at the neighbor for no reason. And don't turn on the lights in the room. The light's already on. Violation occurred. What are you talking? I didn't do nothing. It was already on when I walked in here. I didn't turn on the lights. Why can't I turn off the lights? Is the electrical box downstairs? You took... I wouldn't have been able to turn off the lights in here. It said the lights is broken. Pick at what neighbor? I got a neighbor to pick at? I can't even see out here. Who am I supposed to be picking at? I'm going to bed. We about to have a nightmare, bro. We blew it. We get some sleep, huh? Let's get it in. Escape from the household. Play as a husband escaping from the family on a spooky night. Observe items in the room, solve puzzles, and avoid things inside the house trying to kill you. Tutorial not unlocked yet. Purchase tutorial. 18 game coins. Two. Purchase enemy intelligence. What? Let's just see. Okay, I'm in a house. Uh, all right. Okay, read the note. I sit in the corner of the room waiting for the phone to ring. Suddenly I hear the laughter of a baby. And then I can't see anything. Could I finish reading it? I feel like I'm about to die, but I don't do anything. But nothing happens. I need to find the alarm clock. Those three alarm clocks, I can only escape from here at a special time. Okay, we're going to lose this because that sounds stupid. So find some alarm clocks and don't die. Oh, okay, I ain't peeking on me. What it do, boy? Okay, I'm peeking. This house looks familiar. Not familiar, but these closets and stuff look familiar. I've seen them closets before. Why? We, we need to put some WD 40 on these doors. Can't turn the lights on. That's the rain making that noise? Who that in the floor? Hey, girl, what you doing? You the devil? It's too dark. Can't read the words on top. You see me here, girl? Ma'am, do you see me? Okay. Well, we just gonna leave her there because I don't know what she's doing. She's just chilling on her knees in there. <laughs> I don't know, man. I didn't order no honk honk. Every day at 4 o'clock in the morning, you can hear the voice of the devil. Whose house is this? Just leaving notes around that sound satanic. What is this? What is he a detective? There's no sound at all. <laughs> Alright, well, I haven't found a single alarm clock out. Hello? I'm gonna call this behind me, bro. I like to leave doors open. I feel like this kind of has the ability to manipulate time. So this can change it to four o'clock. Let me see. I don't know what that means. Hello? Okay. What is that? Oh, 
Oh, she so she got up. All right. I don't know the password for the. You need a password for the electrical box? Why would you need that? How am I going to get past this lady? Because she's just walking around a circle. She mad. I'm gone. Oh, Hey, chill out, demon baby. I was supposed to comfort the demon baby. Did I comfort it? Or did it look like Freddy Krueger from the back of the head? You Freddy's baby? I let him know I took care of you, homie. I mean, I comforted you. Oh, that lady. Is she outside? Ma'am, you tripping? I don't know where she at. I think she's still downstairs. Well, she was just sitting on her knees right here. I, I didn't find anything in this house, by the way. I haven't found charcoal. I haven't found an alarm clock. Wait, 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 what? Take the heavy box. What, what this going to do? Check it. The box is still, I can't access what's inside. Oh my God. What is this? Peek to what? I can't see. Hey, I'm gonna shut that baby up. Hey, shut up. Stupid baby. Who puts a table in front of their closet? Now, come on. This game remind me of some other game, bro. Like, we got to do a whole bunch of stuff while getting chased around by other monsters. What's that game? Emily? Emily something? That, that game. <laughs> nah, baby, you're on. What just happened? That picture real familiar. I don't know how many nights it's been. It feels like I've never left this room since I hear a cry of a baby. We heard that already, bro. I found some gasoline in the corner. Okay, she's walking by. I think I gotta I gotta run into her to get caught. Alright. Put the gasoline on that. She can't come around corners now, right? I need I can use a gasoline and a lighter. I don't have a light. I got a candle though. Let me get that candle. Hey, babe, shut up. I don't know what the baby for. I guess he just make my eyes go black. I don't know. <laughs> Shut up, baby. He's supposed to bother you, I guess. He's like, oopsie, I bothered you. You're like, oh, thank you. Okay. Like, I don't know if it's fair if you just keep walking around in the places I, get, I go. I'm in here comforting your baby. Oh. <laughs> Why she walking like that? <laughs> I'm in here comforting her baby and stuff. She in here acting crazy about it. Screw it. I'm gone. Okay. It said that uh, I can't go in here no more. What? Shut up, baby. The couch is gone. Oh, run. What, what's this green note? Oh, so the whole house changed when I cut off that candle. Except for my room. My room is exactly the same. Oh, no, there's an alarm clock. 
Move the hand to the right. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, they said it's at four o'clock, right? You can only move the big. Okay. Let's do four o'clock. They said four o'clock. Some happen. Well, baby, shut up, baby. Who baby is this? Oh, it's another clock. Oh, I'm about to break. Am I supposed to set all the clocks to four? Or something else happened? I know I'm not supposed to get caught by her. Can I go out? No, I can't. Oh, she got me. Oh no, she don't, she don't, she don't. Okay. Maybe she not multifaceted like I think she is. Like, I think unless you actually run into her, you can't get caught by her. So that's what's up. I'm running. I'm running back downstairs. Stupid baby. That dang noise. Okay, turn the candle back on. Everything upstairs should be good, right? Now, what's she doing upstairs again, bro? All right, go back over there. Shut up! I'm done with this game. I mean, I'm done with this. Man, skip this nightmare, bro. I am not doing that again. Day two, bro. Every time the sun flashes into my eyes, this is really over the top. I agree with you. Obtain 5,000 plus. Unforgivable, 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 unforgivable. Okay, he upset about the sun. Like, big mad, bro. They said, the rule is the violation. Attain 5,000 euro through illegal means. Man, just give me the nightmare, bro. Female neighbor. Contact acquired. Female neighbor. This is the neighbor's book filled with many eerie drawings. I'll let me call her up. What's happening, neighbor? Hello, is there anything I can help you with? I would like to purchase your artwork. Human body model wearing a kimono. I'll tell you a secret. There will be a perfect subject subject at the Izakawa Kaya tomorrow night. What? All right. What the heck does that mean? Can I see the drawings? Hey, who that? Hey, bro, bro, let me talk to you, homie. Hey, big, hey, big Willie. The missing workers haven't been found yet. The basements in the area have been sealed off. If we don't fix it soon, the fuse box might break down in the next few days. Uh, without insulated gloves, it's impossible to fix the fuse box. Forget it, it's not my, not my problem. Okay, I gotta get insulated gloves. Uh, yeah, let's purchase dinner. Okay, I got some insulated gloves, y'all. Look, if I had a slingshot, I could definitely hit the camera. Bullseye every time. Okay, that's a surveillance camera, so you can't just be doing whatever you want. I got tools. I can't break up in here and get that stuff. Destroy the air conditioner unit? Why would I do that? Easy Kaya's box? Why would I do any of this? I'd rather just do the nightmares. Forget it. You're right about that sun, though. That's in my eye, boy. Noon. Hey, bro, you better not say the same stuff we said yesterday. Why does Apple always leave early? Who is Apple? Who knows? Maybe she's found a new boyfriend. One day I saw her frequently chatting with her someone on the phone. And the profile picture was a handsome guy. You go ask her. I'm not someone who loves gossip. Alright. Ain't my business. Her name Apple? Apple! Why you always leaving early, girl? <sighs> yes, tell me everything, queen. I know she sneakily updated your resume. Ah, you found out? I've been considering working back in my home country recently. There's this LK4 company that researches the human brain, and I'm quite interested. The password, the day I leave this world, I save this world. Why, why are you up here, male colleague? Y'all know what to do with this key? Do y'all know the password? All right, boss, what's happening, man? I know you. I know you about that BS today. 
Don't be on that BS. Hey, I gotta eat food, bro. Go down, man. I have spaghetti. What my spaghetti, man? I ordered food. What the heck? I ordered spaghetti. Why didn't it come? I get jipped off. I get ripped off. I said jipped off. Can you order only order one thing at a time? What the heck? Pour me a glass of water. Boss, let me pour you a glass of water. Oh, well, I could poison him, right? I'm not going to do that, but let me get him water. I don't have any poison. Oh, I don't want to pour him. I want to get on the water. Hey, I got the boss some water, man. Boss, I got some water for you, bruh. You come over here. I have something to say to you. For the project you've been following from recently, remember to communicate more with the technical personnel from this client side. A few months ago, there was an issue with the Space Museum project in your team, remember? And yeah, what me, though? I'm good at my job. Wait a minute. I need to make a phone call. In the meantime, I think about your experiences and lessons learned. Oh, think about your experiences and lessons learned from your previous project. When I come back, I'll listen to your thoughts. You gotta make a phone call. Boss gotta go poop. Look at that wall. That's the gate of a man that need to boo-boo. All right. I'm about to check your PC. I'll wait for him to come back to his room. I'm about to be all up in your business. You know, I'm nosy. On the shop on the website. Let me see what you're talking about, man. Project is concluded. However, one of our female clients has applied for resignation. Get the address. Okay, get the address. Take a look at the store at the work. Okay, I got the address. I'm nosy. All up in their business. Every time something go down. Hey, what's up, boss? You know, I didn't go through your stuff or nothing, man. You sure you got it all out, but you still got that walk, man. You can leave your wallet over there, dude. I'm back. Feeling a little bit hungry now. What do you feel like having for lunch? Oh, you just decided already? No worries. We'll talk about it later. You can go, you can go now. Thanks, boss. You're a good boss, man. When you ain't uh jumping in my face for some reason. All right, so I got to go to the <laughs> female colleague. Are we still going to the Gizaka Namagama tonight? Izakaya, I mean. <laughs> what I say? Izakama Like I didn't know the name. I'm tired, y'all. All right, let's get some sleep. It feels like I ended another dream. Do you do something in a dream, or is the dream just for play play? Like, what is the dream for? I switch all the lamps on and turn them red to the evil color. What is this? Oh, price of elect. What? Let's see that. Anyone who sees this text, I will give you some necessary hints. You may have been affected by a program. At least I am. If you see this text, it means you're in, in a nightmare. I survived it in this nightmare, and there are a few things that must be done. Turn on the red light. Find the key near the whiteboard in this room and put it in the cabinet in the boss's room. Number of video. Play a video. Ah, oh, are you still working overtime at this late hour? Is there only you in the company? Why is it so dark around? Yes. I'm still working overtime. I'm a bit scared, so I thought I'd chat with you for a while. What's wrong? Have you encountered any problems? It's okay. I just keep feeling like someone's outside a moment ago. As if waiting for me to come out. I heard footsteps. Speaking of which, how did your father's surgery go? Is he feeling any better? Ah, that's good to hear. Glad to know he's been in good spirits these days. I'm really short on money right now. I wish I could work five jobs at once. You girl know you don't. Okay, the red light is on. Not wrong too. If you're short on money, I can lend you some. It's not a problem. I really don't want this job anymore. The overtime is too severe. The boss is crazy. Okay. Two ex female employees? I don't know what's going on. By the way. You know, our company headquarters is considered buying some robots to replace some routine tasks. It seems like many industries can be replaced by robots now. What is going on in this place? What's that? Hey, with that dog behind you, bro? Where are you planning to go this weekend? I'll be working at the convenience store this weekend. I don't have weekends. I don't have weekends. It's exhausting, but I have no choice. I need to work hard to earn money and pay off debts. It's really hard to keep going. Yeah, it sucks, don't it? All right, it's important to stay optimistic. All right, after all, being angry can cause wrinkles. Oh, is your company by doll? This one behind you looks very cute. The doll behind me? Uh, uh, don't scare me. Here, 
You said there were dolls here? Let me tell you, I recently got a very strange project. Anyway, the client is a seller of dolls. At first, there wasn't much of a problem, but not long after, a lot of strange things started happening around. The, those dolls seem to come to life. I always have nightmares where those dolls are chasing me. You probably won't believe what I'm saying. Those dolls are afraid of light, especially red light. I don't know why. If you really see the dolls, I better light up, the room with, up this room with red light. I feel something isn't right. I better go home. The other girl like, um, all right. She got it. The door is locked. Oh, no. Where's my key? There should be a spare key in the shelf in the meeting room. I remember it's in the box. Isn't that the boss's office? What do you mean, the, the meeting room? I guess the this is the meeting room. The boss is never at his desk. The spare key should be right here. Oh no, the key is missing. I can't get out. What's that sound? Is that thing here? Call the police for me. Uh, why aren't you speaking anymore? Hello? <laughs> the video has been terminated. Maybe I need to put the key in the cabinet in the meeting room in advance. Next time, I should try to continue watching this video. I wake up from the dream, realize it's time to go back to work. Time to continue with my tasks. Okay, I'm doing that. Oh, let's go to the story store, bro. Let's see what's cracking. Hey, Mickey Mouse. Got some mega bars with choco slices, some crusties, and sweet chops, bro. Hello, welcome to our store. We are a 24-hour operating shop. During unmanned, unmanned nighttime hours, we select your items to proceed with self-checkout. If you encounter any issues, that is an understanding place, bro. Hello, I, I want to buy some special merchandise. Uh, special merchandise has been detected. May I ask what specific item you're referring to? In, uh, uh, I don't know. What, like, what's it supernatural? What is the purpose of your purchase? Uh, sorry, I'm unable to process your request. Okay, I don't know what the heck you're talking about. I want to buy something. The keyword shopping has been detected. Okay. Can't rob the place? This isn't like the perfect place to rob. And, uh, and no employees. I came here for no reason. Um... I don't know why I'm here. I don't know what this game is. There's a lot going on, and it's not particularly telling me anything. I know I'm supposed to be following the rules and something like that, but I'm not doing that because I don't care. Leave your rules up your butt. I came over here to check to see if there's anything special over here. Yeah, no. Some coffee. Oh, you can buy some coffee. That's some expensive coffee, boy. All right, go. Oh, that's the homie. Hey. There's more people in here today. Okay. Uh, who is you, bro? Hello. What are you eating? I haven't eaten anything. Just want to have some beer. Is this your first time here? I haven't seen you before. I'm a regular at this place. I come here often, even if it's just to sit alone for a while. Okay, that's what's up, bro. Enjoy your life. Urinate in his glass? <laughs> what's wrong with me? That's unprovoked. Hey, let me get him up. No. Hey, good evening. Oh, hey, yes. Have you seen the recent movie, They're All Watching You? There seems to be something strange in the corner of the protagonist's house. I'm not sure if it's an Easter egg or maybe just a blooper. I have to tell you, I enjoy spotting these details when, when watching movies. Anyway, I feel like the plot of this movie is average. A bit cliche. Speaking of which, there are really a lot of movies where young people gather and encounter terrifying events. I can give you a website where I often watch horror films. You should check it out. Cool. Apart from horror movies, I also enjoy playing horror games. You can search for my videos on YouTube. My name is Glum. Something in Japanese, I don't know. Don't forget to give it a like before you go. Uh, yeah, for sure. I gotta, I can't, I gotta eat the salad. I mean, I thought I would just come in here every day to eat. There's a salad? I went to the toy store. There's nothing in it. Ma'am, do you know how I eat food? <laughs> okay, I don't know how to eat food. Hey, bro, I'm trying to eat some food, man. I can't eat it though. When he, I bought a salad, right? And I can't eat the I can't eat the salad. You know why I can't eat the salad? You know there's a legend of a female ghost in the basement nearby. You mean that female ghost? I know I might even have I might even know the truth about it. I saw a post in a certain forum, but it got deleted later. It mentioned this incident. According to the official statement, the husband killed the wife, and then husband and then the husband disappeared. But the post mentioned that in reality, the husband was killed in self defense by his wife. And then the wife disposed of the husband's body. However, the wife didn't realize that the husband had coated the knife with poison. The husband killed his wife 
and then the husband disappeared. But the post mentioned that in reality, the husband was killed in self-defense by the wife, and then the wife disposed of the husband's body. However, the wife didn't realize that the husband had coated the knife with poison. Consequently, the wife also died and became a vengeful spirit. Oh, he was killed in self-defense. I wasn't paying attention to that part at first. The vengeful spirit appears in a nearby basement or dark corners at night. The spirit seeks to resurrect her husband through a ritual to exact revenge once again. I'm not sure if the post is true or not, but it sounds intriguing. Do you like these horror stories now? No wonder you suddenly wake up during your lunch break every day. All your lunch break dreams are also horror stories. Do you know the password for the female colleague? Huh? Why are you asking about this? I saw the password hand on her computer. The day I saved the world. I guess this would, should be her birthday. There's an employee handbook in the boss's computer, which should have her birthday. Wait a minute. Why are you asking this? You said you're just curious. Please don't do anything bad. I mean, I'm trying to see what's in the locker. She ain't around no more, bro. You going out for smoke? Sure. Have you started vaping? Nah, I don't smoke, bro. I'm just trying to see if you got some food left I can eat. Apparently, I can't eat that. Oh, this is where I could have called the neighbor up and got my man murdered. But I wouldn't do that. Hey, where you go? Bro, man. You around the back on me? Where'd he go? Bruh? Brusky. That boy gone. Sir. Where'd he go to smoke? Man. All right. Hey, bro, you need a beer, you said? Let me get you a beer, bro. Hey, man, let me get a uh, 1400. Um, all right, let's get the beer from my man. It's only 1500. 1550, I mean. Okay, thank you. Hey, bro, you want a beer? All right, I'm leaving. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Uh, my boy disappeared. He off in the, in the wild blue yonder. I don't know what's going on in this game, bro. I have no idea. Hey, old man, what's good with it, bro? Let me get the uh, sushi. Yeah, and uh, uh, a whiskey, bro. Thank you, sir. And uh, can I actually eat it? Oh, my goodness. You eat the food after you after you buy it and it just stays there? Hold on, bro. I'm, if I go back to this place and there's a salad in front of that lady, because she said I already bought the salad, but I also just bought a beer. I'm not hungry no more now. The, the beer is here. But why couldn't I buy a salad from you, ma'am? I'm a bit drunk, baby, off that liquor. That's a good liquor, too. Harvey, you, this website feels strange. You always have a sense that something will happen tonight. I always have a sense something will happen tonight. No! Why did you do this to me? I'm robbing you tonight. You know, I can't reach in the cash register. All right. So I'm about to be visited by the ghost of Christmas past tonight. Oh, well, at least I got that liquor in me. Yeah! All right, I'm heading home. I don't know what happened to my friend. He went and he smoked, and that was it. Never saw him again. Day two, night. Prohibited to turn the lights off. I can't turn them off. Don't take his trash out. Either. Oh, I can make the spaghetti. Making a bento. This is the lunch I made. I'll bring it to the company tomorrow at noon. Okay, I can eat that. Hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. I'm going to bed. <laughs> what is this game? Nightmare One. Escape from the house. I don't want to play this no more. This game sucks. I hate this nightmare. And the baby killed me last time. The baby. All right, I kind of got a clue. There she is. She already on her knees. Right, get the gasoline. The gasoline ain't in here. So the gasoline switches. 11 o'clock, you hear the voice of the devil. I hate this, bro. They they switch where the gasoline is at. Okay, let's change. Oh, there's the gasoline, bro. Okay, the gasoline. So things change in this game. That's crazy. I never knew. Okay, she gone. Can't read the notes because I don't have the fire button button needs to be continuously pressed by 
the base to activate. Activate what? Oh, what button? To, to activate. Oh, last time it was green. Remember? By that one spot. What is it this time? My wife's been saying strange things. All she does every day is pray. I saw her running around the house in a strange posture. Well, that's what she's doing right now. Her crazy blip. That's the lighter. We ain't got the lighter. <laughs> we got the lighter. The baby's a problem. Okay, apparently she a problem too. All the stuff better not be in different places, bro. And I know all oh, the lighters right here, bro. Yes, sir. Okay. And I know when I'm late. Man. And I don't need me one thing. Ever since I let the dick, you, you, you. There's gasoline, too. You better not have moved. She moved. Got the lighter. I ran into her on my own last time, bro. I'm trying to read this. Password for the electrical box is what? Oh, I just go put it in. That's what's up. Run down here. Disable. There's many switches here. I don't know what to do. There's a small line. If you want to escape from here, seek the help of the devil. Okay, I got to get the devil to whisper to me tonight. Devil like, yeah. Always come back to me, don't it? <laughs> You need your boy now, don't you? Six o'clock is the devil night. Okay. <laughs> Stupid baby! You better not kill me. I comforted the baby! Do I, I can I not move or something? I gotta do this again. The lighter, no! We had it. I was gone. What's up with you, girl? Hope it's good to you on your knees over there. Oh, maybe, oh, that's what he means. She was praying. He said that she was always praying. So she's supposed to be praying right there. But, you know, she's doing it in a way where she just got her hands by her side. Okay, what time the devil coming? Six o'clock again. Okay, six for the devil. And then you answer the phone when the devil, when you set the alarm clock. Okay. Okay, got the gasoline. We'll pour that on there. Got to find a lighter now. Don't know where it is. Uh, all right. Hold up. There she comes. I like your dress, man. Not bad, you know. All right. <laughs> Back upstairs. Okay, you can't move while the baby is uh, crying. Oh no, I'm gone. Okay. Girl, stop all that. She went right back that way. Okay, you said six. That's when the devil gonna call. Okay, green for this. Ugh. Oh, you can't move it right now. Okay. Green for this door. And orange. <laughs> and <bri> <laughs> okay. I can't cover the baby because the baby in the room, I can't get into. So I got to I gotta unlock. Wow, I got one of the hard ones, bro. I got to unlock the doors to get in. <laughs> Shut up, baby. Because of the baby, I had to die. Nightmare 4? I just did a nightmare. My man can't get out of the nightmares. Huh? What this is? I came back out of the TV, y'all.
Good evening. Welcome to the weather forecast. Friday, temperature 22 degrees, sunny weather, no wind, a rare good weather. Saturday, temperature 19 degrees, heavy rain expected. Autumn is approaching. Please remember to keep warm. Sunday, temperature 18 degrees, moderate rain. It is not recommended to engage in outdoor activities. As the season progresses, daytime temperatures gradually decrease, making early mornings and evenings cooler and prompting people to wear want to wear light jackets or capes to experience the fresh autumn air. The county will soon hold a crop harvest competition. Please bring your results to participate. We will compare the size of crops as the judging criteria and select the largest crop. Looking forward to your participation in the competition. Now we interrupt this program to bring you a missing person announcement. A 21-year-old college student has gone missing in recent days. Male, height, 170 centimeters, uh, 77 centimeters, weight, 40, 74 kg, last seen wearing black clothing. The missing person is a college student majoring in agriculture. He came to this county for agricultural internship activities and lost contact after 8 p.m. last night. Family members and the police are still unable to contact him. Please pay attention to whether you have seen this person. If you have any clues, please contact the police until using the contact information below. According to the missing person's diary, he received a research invitation on crop planting on the day of his disappearance. However, it is unclear where he specifically went. If you have any clues, please contact the police using the contact information below. Okay. Welcome to Watch County Agricultural. Today we will begin. Can I get out of here? Uh, the county legend has it that a long time ago there was a severe drought there there was no rain throughout the year and the crops fell many people starved to death among them was a simple far farmer who unable to endure hunger decided to journey to the nearby mountains in search of immortals praying for rain it was a very tall mountain and it took about three months to walk from the foot of the mountain to the summit during the drought year there were there was simply not enough food to reach the mountaintop the farmer then gathered the remaining people in the village and begged everyone to give him the remaining food. He promised that he would climb to the mountaintop, find the immortals, and save everyone. Although the villagers wanted to help him, there was indeed no surplus food left. What should they do? Were they all going to starve to death because of the drought? Suddenly, the farmer proposed a bold idea. He begged everyone to cut off a piece of meat from their own bodies and give it to him. This way he would have enough meat to climb to the mountaintop. Although this idea was crazy, compared to starving to death, the villagers accepted it. So they all cut off a piece of meat from their bodies and gave it to the farmer. The farmer obtained enough food and prepared to set off. Before departing, he also brought many, along many expensive ornaments and gold intended to offer them to the immortals. The process of climbing the mountain was painful. The farmer's feet was rubbed raw and his vision became blurred. The meat he brought along was also running out. Fortunately, with only the last piece of meat, pe uh, place a piece of meat remaining, the farmer reached the mountaintop and met the immortals. I pray here for you to bring rain upon us. The farmer knelt on the ground and said to the immortals. The immortals ignored him, just waved their hands. Suddenly, thunder roared around and a torrential rain began. The farmer, seeing the rain, burst into tears. The immortals turned their backs on the farmer and said, I have brought the rain upon you. What can you give me in return? The farmer immediately presented the ornaments and gold, which sparkled brightly. But the immortals said, What use do I have for these worldly possessions? The immortals continued, this is still, There is still a piece of meat in your backpack. Just give that to me. The farmer looked at the immortals in astonishment. They handed over the piece of meat to them. The immortals turned their back to him and ate the meat. Remember, as long as the rain doesn't stop, your meat won't stop either, said the immortals. The farmer became a little afraid understood thank you for your help after the farmer finished speaking he planned to leave quickly as the farmer passed by the side of the immortals he saw the face of the immortals clearly through the reflection of the rain water on the ground it was a twisted face ten times more terrifying than a monster ten times more evil than anything imaginable the farmer fled in panic in the end the entire village was saved dear audience this is the legend of the autumn festival in our county every year at this time we bury pork and beef in the ground to thank for this year's rain and pray for the next year's rain Thank you for watching. Don't forget about the ritual. See you next time. Right. It's time to prepare for the witcher. I need to pour the meat into the soil. Pour the meat into the soil. Okay. There are many crops. Okay, let's get this light on. Where do I got some meat at? There are many crops. Seems like there's something buried in the soil. 
Is that the meat? Where the meat at? I ain't trying to make them mad, bro. They said, well, as long as we got meat, we good. Okay, barrel of meat is about to rot. Okay, let me throw that up in there, bro. All right, use that. The meat chest is too big. I have to cut them in smaller pieces. Okay, with a knife fat. Where do we cut these up at, bro? Okay, take the shears and go back to the bucket. I'm sorry. What's going on? Okay, I cut the meat up. I poured the meat in. Okay. The ritual is complete. Let's go watch TV, man. TV again? I don't want to watch no more TV, bro. Had enough. We ain't watching TV. I'm doing all the reading. The same news channel? You ain't got no other channel to watch. Where your stories at, bro? Friday, okay. Same stuff, bro. I'm not reading that again. Yeah. You said that. Yup. You have any? Okay. It changed the color this time. You are me. 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 So I'm the me. I was at a farmer's house at the time. I found a secret passion beneath their house. I went down and took this picture. There's a lot of meat inside. A lot. A lot of meat. They've always been using meat to grow vegetables. They are appeasing an evil god. Lots of meat. Lots of meat. Uh, all right. Is that who's buried down there, bro? Did I kill the dude and that's who dead body that is? It said something was buried in there before I put the meat in. What was that sound just now? Is someone outside the door? Did someone just knock just now? All right, bro. What is this? What is this? Did I forget to deal with this fertilizer? It looks like I need to shred this fertilizer now. Okay, these are bodies. Bro. You say so, bro. Right. Bro, there's some bodies, bro. Okay. Shredded the piece. This is a literal hand sticking out of there. What's wrong with us? We sick. Oh, shredded. Let's go check the TV. I recommend it. Okay. Just get to the point, man. Alright, we already killed him, bro. Please lock your doors and windows immediately. Do not go outside. We have received multiple reports of residents being attacked by humanoid creatures. More humanoid creatures are emerging from fields and attacking pedestrians. Please stay indoors and await further instructions for... I don't want to watch them. The nightmare is concluded. Thank you for your participation. There's always a lot of negative thoughts at this time. Indeed. This is only this time is only suitable for sleeping. Since there's nobody in the street anyway, let's close our eyes and take a walk to rest. Alright, man. Um I've been playing this for like an hour. And I don't know what's going on. If y'all want to see more of this, it's a wild ride already. And they said it's seven days. I'm only on day three. But y'all want to see more of this for some reason. Y'all let me know. You know what I'm saying? Hit the like button. Subscribe, comment. Let me know, bro. Because this is a wild game. I'm actually interested in it. As in trying to figure out what's going on. That's all. But, uh, peace.